Greetings, fellow seekers of the unknown. Today, we're delving into the heart of the unexplained, into the eerie realm of the Bridgewater Triangle, a mysterious area in Massachusetts that has left investigators and thrill-seekers baffled for decades. The Bridgewater Triangle, a 200-square-mile area, is notorious for its high concentration of paranormal activity. It forms a triangle between the towns of Abington, Rehoboth, and Freetown, creating a hotbed for inexplicable occurrences that have left residents and experts scratching their heads. Our journey begins with tales of the Hockamock Swamp, a sprawling, dense wilderness that has been the source of countless legends. Native American folklore speaks of strange creatures lurking within, and to this day, reports of bizarre encounters continue to surface. But it's not just the swamp that's shrouded in mystery. Let's talk about the mysterious Freetown State Forest, where hikers and explorers have reported strange lights, unexplained noises, and even encounters with shadowy figures. One of the most spine-chilling stories comes from 1970s, when a series of cattle mutilations occurred in the Triangle. Livestock found with surgical precision, as if the work of extraterrestrial forces or a cult with sinister intentions. The mysteries only deepen when we turn our attention to the infamous Pukwudgies. These small, troll-like creatures from Native American mythology are said to inhabit the Triangle, causing mischief and even harm to those who cross their path. Now, let's not forget the Bridgewater Triangle's connection to UFO sightings. Numerous reports of strange lights in the sky and unexplained aerial phenomena have been documented, raising questions about extraterrestrial activity in the area. But what is it about the Bridgewater Triangle that makes it a magnet for the unexplained? Is it a convergence of paranormal energies? Or could there be a more earthly explanation for these strange occurrences? I decided to embark on a journey to the heart of the Bridgewater Triangle, speaking with locals, exploring the sites, and attempting to uncover the truth behind the mysteries that have haunted this region for centuries. What I discovered was a tapestry of folklore, urban legends, and first-hand accounts that paint a picture of a place where reality and the supernatural collide. Within the mysterious Freetown State Forest, where inexplicable lights dance through the dense foliage and eerie noises resonate through the night. One resident vividly describes the eerie ambience, stating, I felt an overwhelming sense of dread as if unseen eyes were watching my every move. The Triangle's history is marred by a series of cattle mutilations in the 1970s, with eyewitnesses attesting to the bizarre precision of the mutilations. A resident from that era recalls, it was like nothing I had ever seen before, surgical in its precision. We couldn't fathom what could have done such a thing. Additionally, the legends of Pukwudgies, mischievous creatures from Native American folklore, persist with locals recounting encounters with these elusive beings. The Bridgewater Triangle, with its confluence of inexplicable phenomena and haunting testimonies, remains a perplexing realm where the boundaries between reality and the supernatural blur. The Bridgewater Triangle remains an enigma Challenging our understanding of the Bridgewater Triangle stands as a testament to the mysteries that continue to elude explanation. What secrets does this land hold? And will we ever truly understand the forces at play within its boundaries? Thank you for joining me on this journey into the heart of the unknown. If you have your own stories or insights into the Bridgewater Triangle, share them in the comments below. And until next time, stay curious, stay vigilant, and embrace the mysteries that surround us. This is the Frightening Finds channel signing off. Until next time.